The Wire Fox Terrier is one of the oldest recognized breeds. References can be found to the Wire Fox Terrier in English sporting records of the late 18th century. The Fox Terrier has always been of two varieties and is now recognized as two separate breeds, each with its own standard. The Smooth Fox Terrier on the left and the Wire Fox Terrier on the right. Although the standards for each are very similar, they have been recognized as separate breeds since 1985. This presentation will concentrate on the Wire Fox Terrier. You'll be seeing many examples of the breed during this program. Some are outstanding, others are less so. But all of them will help your understanding. Now, let us begin. Balance is the keystone in the Wire Fox Terrier's anatomy, states the standard. That means the dog's proportions, skull to foreface, for example, or height to length, should be within certain relationships to each other. We'll discuss each of these relationships as we go along. But remember, it's the overall impression these proportions create that's important. When judging, you should ask yourself, is there sufficient balance in the head? Are the jaws, particularly the underjaw, strong and powerful? Do the legs and feet suit the dog for hard work? But when making your decision, remember, it's the total dog that's being judged, not just certain parts. If the anatomy of the dog you're evaluating is correctly balanced, you should get a pleasing impression of a graceful, active, keenly intelligent dog eager for work or play.